Good morning, everybody. As we are taking you on a very special live look around the Brass Armadillo this morning, hopefully giving you some great ideas as we're heading very close. I believe, what, 12 days left uh, towards Christmas. So we're counting down, but don't worry, still plenty of time making this your one stop shop of your destination of everyone on your list. Um, and we were in the front foyer. What would you call this area over here? This is our open case selection. Um, it's that's what it is called. It's just <laughs> open cases. It doesn't get any simpler than that. Because um, you have various vendors who set up uh, amazing booths all around. But yep. if, if you have maybe smaller collections, yep. you have an opportunity to be in a case like this. Some enclosed, um, some that are open, and that's where we are right now. Yep, yep. This is, uh, this is a good starting point for anybody that's maybe thinking about selling some of their collection or stuff. Um, this is the, the cheapest uh, we have to start out here. Um, these start at $48 every four weeks. Um, so it's a, it's a good starting point if you're looking on selling any of your collection or just getting into the, the business. Because you're always looking for new vendors as yeah. well as besides shoppers that we're encouraging to come in. You're always looking for new vendors as well. That is correct. Uh, that's probably one of the, the things people don't know about the store is we actually don't own any of the merchandise. Um, we rent the space out to all individual dealers. So it's, uh, <laughs> it's interesting because people think that we you know, own all this, but yeah. we just rent the space. So, But that's why you can always get new things in here yep. because it's individuals that are bringing it to you. And we were talking a little bit of everything. Well, what's something that's really hot uh, right now, not only for the holidays, but any day of the week, and that is albums. They are coming back better than ever, and we're talking about the classics, uh, Tony. So tell us a little bit about over here uh, the Holy Grail vinyl. <laughs> the Holy Grail is a, is a, a couple that... Um, They've been specializing in vinyl for many, many, many years. They are professionals. Um, they find nothing but the cream of the crop when it comes to vintage, you know, vinyl and LPs, 30, you know, 38s and 78s and 45s. They've got a great selection here. I mean, amazing. Um, they've all jacketed. They're all tagged to tell you what they are. They're easily found. Um, they've got them categorized. It's just vinyl's big now, and vent this vendor 219 is what we refer to them as. But their business name is the Holy Grail Vinyl, and it kind of fits them because when you walk in and find their cases, it is the Holy Grail. I mean, they find some very hard-to-find albums, and the price point's phenomenal. Anywhere from $3 up to, well, there's a few that are a little pricey because they're very hard to find, um, but they range anywhere between, you know, 3 and up to $35, $45. Yeah, you can't go wrong uh, when you're looking at some of these classics, and uh, whether you're a hard rocker, we have Rat down there. I see some ACDC, little Rod Stewart uh, back when he used to wear the really fun outfits, um, Hart, uh, Hendrix, you name it. Um, you're seeing uh, some of the best of the best in the rock and roll world, and it, maybe even if it's not for the album that's inside, these were known for the artwork on the cover, the jackets. Yes. Um, so people might even just want to collect those. Absolutely. We have one vendor in particular, um, 761. He's in the back of the store. He has something but jackets, and they are phenomenal. And those retail anywhere between 3 and $5. But, yes, they do collect them for the artwork. All right. So if you're talking about those collectibles, uh, you know, someone in your life that might enjoy them, uh, this is where you need to go. Okay. So just kind of showing you the span of the space and how there's literally no way possible we can show you everything this morning. But we just uh, can want to continue to uh, look at some of the highlights. Coca-Cola, another huge one uh, that people always enjoy. What are some other things that kind of catch your eye, Tony? Oh my gosh, there's so much. It's kind of overwhelming when you first walk in because there's just so much to see. But you'll see anywhere from ruby glassware up to Fenton pieces, old calendars and postcards, pillows and, and old games from, you know, from the 1920s and 30s and into the 40s. Um, lots of unique, fun pieces. Chalk where I used to find the old carnivals. I mean, those are lots of fun to collect too. And we have many pieces of those. Um, stoneware, um, Christmas items. And this is, this is a fun one. Really like, oh. This is a muff. Oh, it's a muff, a fur muff. Okay, so we're ending on one of my favorites. It's a muff. It's a muff. Did you ever think you would find incredible accessories like this at Brass Armadillo? Well, we're going to show you more. Good find. I like that. Uh, we'll be back with more as you're watching CWI Will Live here on Channel 23. Don't go anywhere. We're going to continue to take you around the store this holiday season.